Hello, my name is Laura Barby. I am the subject leader for Film Studies A-Level here at Barton Peveril College. Um, nice to see you through the screen. Let me talk you through a little bit about what we do on the course in Film Studies. So, Film Studies is a lot like English literature in a way. Um, we are in the business of analysing films to search for the meaning. Um, we look at film as an art form and we start to take apart how the director has technically constructed moving images on screen in order to make meaning. In order to study this film at A-level, we would like you to have uh, four at your GCSE for English. That's because it's quite a lot of uh, writing for us. As you can see on the screen here, oh, on screen here, um, it's 30% coursework, which is practical. So that's filmmaking, screenplay writing, and things like that. Like, so there's some creative practical elements to the course, which we love to do. But 70% of the course is um, essay-based exam assessments. So we do need you to have your English. So let's get down to the sorts of things you can look forward to studying with us in our amazing film studies course at Barton Peveril. We try to show you a whole world of different types of films, hopefully things that you have not seen before. So we look at some old Hollywood film texts, which is an Alfred Hitchcock film called Vertigo. We look at some newer Hollywood film texts and we sort of like try to unpick, well, how has Hollywood changed and how do these two different films films styles compare. We have a couple of films that are British, of course, on our specification, and those are Train Spotting and Shaun of the Dead. And we're looking at the narrative construction of those films and also the ideology of those films. What are those films saying about um, the British psyche, British society? We look at a mainstream film text and that's got to be a big glossy Hollywood film that doesn't get much bigger and much glossier than La La Land. So we look at what the director is trying to communicate um, to us through that big glossy musical. And we also look when we're looking at that um, at what the director is not saying as well, sort of reading between the lines. For that particular film, we talk a lot about spectator and we talk a lot about emotional response. It's a bit of a Marmite film. You either love it or you hate it a lot with La La Land. So we're kind of looking at how audiences, how those readings or reactions to the film have been constructed. Oh, we look at all kinds of different things. We look at documentaries. We look at silent uh, films from Germany in the 1920s, a film movement called German Expressionism. It's a uh, film with studies right there behind me. It's called Spies. Um, and we also look at one of my personal favourites, French New Wave. And we look at a film called Vivre Sa Vie. Um, it's very, very cool. It's quite surreal. And it's going to be really challenging for you to sort of like unpick how the director is trying to make meaning with films in a surreal, different, not Hollywood, alternative kind of way. Um, so choosing film studies, what will you get? You will get um, a film or a screenplay to put in your portfolio. Um, when the time is right and things are safe, we will take you on some amazing trips. Oh, look, there's a picture of some of our students in Los Angeles. So we try and get you out of the classroom as much as possible. In the past, we have gone on set visits. Um, we have gone to the London Film Festival. We try and get you out and getting as much experience as possible. We went to Pinewood Studios last year for a, for a little tour, and we saw some of the Black Widow sets being sort of like put up. So that was really cool. Um, we have visiting lecturers come in to talk to us. We will have directors come in to talk to us. People who work in the film business will come in and talk to us. We try and set you up. If you want to get into filmmaking in the future, it's really great to have an understanding of how films like make meaning, but also a lot of like how films get made, the background. So we try and set you up for that. Um, filmmaking is a thriving industry in the UK. It is not a pipe dream if you want to get into making films. It is a reality if that's what you want to do. 
And if you are just interested in films, if you like analysing films, if you're already that person when you're watching a film and you're thinking, oh, that shot is really interesting. Why would they film it in that way? Why would the director like this person in that way? Why would you cut to that image after that image? If you're that type of person that's starting to deconstruct how things look on screen, you're already in. Um, and we consolidate and we assess you through a lot of essay writing. And that is something that we coach you through as you go. I don't have much time to talk to you today. Um, but I hope that you find this little short intro video useful. Um, you can find out more by clicking on that link. And I've put a little poster ooh, right there, um, just breaking down there the, the sorts of things that we will be examining when we look at a film. Um, I hope to see you in September, or maybe even before. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. <laughs>